in the doctor's office. It is a gloomy day. And I'm just waiting to see the doctor. It's 1.32. My appointment was at 1 o'clock. I got in the back. Maybe about 1.20. So, yeah. Right now, I'm just waiting. Blood pressure was good. So, let's see about this A1C. Hey, y'all. Good morning. It is Saturday. And I'm getting ready to head out and go to the hairdresser, y'all. I need to get this hair done. Y'all see all those grays coming through? I'm not ashamed. <laughs> So, yeah, um, there's really nothing much on the agenda today. Um, like I said, I'm going to get my hair done. And probably when I'm when I leave there, I am going to the grocery store because I need to stock up. I need to go to the grocery store and I need to go to the meat house. Um, <clears throat> so, yeah, I'm going to it is well, what time is it? It is about 1020 and my hair appointment isn't until 11 o'clock. So, I've already eaten breakfast. The hubby cooked breakfast this morning. Yay! So, right now, I think I have two loads of clothes to wash. The girls' clothes. And I'm going to change my linen today. Um, but other than that, no washing. Um, so, yeah. Let me go ahead and get off of here. Finish getting dressed. I was going to go to the uh gym before i went to the hairdresser but waited to the last minute to get up mm -hmm. like i said yeah so let me get up here because i feel like i'm rambling and i will touch back in i don't know if i'm gonna pick you guys back up while i'm at the hairdresser or while i'm at the store but either way i'll touch back in with you guys later bye Alright, just leaving the hairdresser, gonna head over here to Win Dixie. They have a bag of Golden Delicious apples for $5.29, whereas the regular one apple is $2.99 a pound. So it might be cheaper for me to get a bag. I've never seen these before. Exciting, beautiful. Hmm. I wonder how they taste. Y'all, I'm not a drinker, so has anyone tried this black box uh, drink? I have no idea what I'm looking at. I know that's a Chardonnay. So, uh, let us just know.
Oh, that smells so good. Now, let's see how it tastes. Oh, I love spicy. But it's good. Alright, y'all. It is a little later in the day. I want to say it's almost about 6.20. And I'm just sitting out here on the front porch. Well, under my carport, not the front porch. My son and hubby is throwing something on the grill again. And... <clears throat> We have some sausages and hot dogs on the grill and getting ready to um, put some hamburgers on in a little bit. It just finished raining and the sun is trying to come back out. So, yeah, we will see how that goes. So, just want to come on here and say, hey, touch bases with you guys and I'll check in with you later. Hey, y'all. Good morning. Today is Monday, and I am getting ready to head to the gym for about an hour and come back and do a couple of loads of laundry. Yeah, I've missed the gym. I haven't been in three weeks, so it's time to get back to get back to going. So, I will probably check in with you guys when I get to the gym. Hey, y'all. So I have made it back from the gym. Whew, that was a workout. It is 10.53, almost 11 o'clock, and I was in there for maybe a little an hour. Um, I did the treadmill, and I did a little leg workout. So I just wanted to come on here, sit down, and chat with you guys for a little bit. I haven't did a chat in a while. So... Um, you probably have not seen that video, but I went to the doctor last week, um, and my numbers is, for those of you that don't know, I'm a type 2 diabetic, so, um, my numbers were not all that good. Um, from the last time I saw my primary doctor, they didn't change, they didn't go up, and they didn't go down, which I guess is okay. Um, it didn't go up, which is good, but the object is for it to go down, uh, which was my A1C level. So, I always told myself I would not go on insulin. That was something I did not want to do. But, lo and behold, she put me on insulin. It's just, um, what is it? I think it's Lantis. Um, and it is only take what 10 millimeters I think it's millimeters at night before bedtime um, she basically told me maybe my body because I take the oral medicines also so basically she was like well maybe your body has just gotten immune to the medicine um, I'm like mm, yeah it could be because I've been taking that medicine for a while my numbers were Okay, and then um, I guess when my primary doctor took a leave of absence and this other um, doctor, I guess, uh, what, took over her patients or whatever, and I was needing my medicine, she was denied <laughs> my medicine because I hadn't been to the doctor to see my primary doctor in a little over three months. I'm like, why are you denying my medicine? I need my medicine. But long story short, regardless, um, so I think that had a little bit to do with it too, as far as why my numbers didn't change because I was out of two of my particular medicines for like three months. 
That's how long my doctor, my February doctor was gone on vacation. I guess she took a leave of absence. Um, but yeah, so I ended up, because for those of you, if you're a diabetic, type 1, type 2, you know you have to finger prick, prick your finger and test your blood, blue, your blood glucose and all of that. And I'm like, I told my primary, I'm like, you know what, that's just, I'm tired of pricking my finger. I'm not going to do it anymore. It's just, it is what it is. Because it's only, you only have, what, 10 fingers? And you can only stick your finger in so many places, even if you rotate. Eventually, you're going to come back to that place and it doesn't heal. Well, my fingers, I don't know about anybody else, doesn't heal as fast as they used to when I was young. So, I got this little machine here, which is the Dexcom. And I have a little, I can't show you right now, I can little sit down. Well, hello. But I have this little thing right here on my stomach that monitors, that's the transmitter that monitors my glucose levels um, constantly. It's updated every five minutes. So yesterday was not a good day. Um, I knew my sugars was high because it was just the way that I was feeling. Normally when they're high, I, uh, I get sleepy. <laughs> and yesterday was no exception. They're average normally not low. My sugars do not go below 90, maybe once I can remember. So, but yeah, normally they're high. And yesterday, like I said, it, it was high. So I didn't take uh, my insulin until it was about 8.30 last night. Um, and throughout the day, I could feel it coming down a little bit, but this was beeping throughout the night. It was just, it went down. Um, right now it is at 200, which is still a little high, but I just finished, um, like I said, working out and I had a little protein bar. So, um, I set it where, uh, it beeps when my low is below 90 and when my high is above 200. So I may have to change that high. <laughs> But, yeah, um, this is, like I said, this is the machine, the Dexcom G6 that I'm using now. So, now I don't have to finger prick, <laughs> finger prick, prick my fingers at all. This monitors me constantly, 24-7. Um, the needle that I take for the insulin is not that big at all. My husband gave me the shot yesterday, and, um, I'm not afraid of needles. It, it wasn't it wasn't as bad as I thought it was gonna be so I think I'm gonna start this series uh, called living with diabetes or just take you on my journey of living with diabetes because uh, I guess I have to take it serious now before I took it serious but not as serious as I'm supposed to take it so I need to start doing and I've already started doing my own research um, you know, on this medicine and I plan on going to a dietitian because the last time they don't speak it in English. I took this class as far as what you can eat, what you can't eat. And it's like everything, everything has hidden sugar. And I'm like, okay, well maybe I can eat it in moderation, but yeah. Mm -hmm. So hope you guys come along with me on that journey i just wanted to give you a little life update um i don't normally open up about stuff like this but i was like you know what if i can help one person that's great <laughs> if i can help two people that's even great if one person hears what i'm saying and you know it's okay life happens and i guess that's where I'm at now as far as you know it's okay <laughs> I'm a type 2 diabetic it's okay it's not the end of the world um as long as I get my numbers in order and control where they're supposed to be at I'm good um so yeah I am going to get off of here now <sighs> it's almost lunch time and I need to figure out what I'm going to eat. I think I'm going to make me a fish sandwich because I, um, you guys will probably 
see this video um, before my grocery haul. Oh no, you'll probably see this video after my grocery haul. And in that haul, I uh, got some card fillets from um, when Dixie. I feel like I'm talking loud to y'all because this, this, my phone is ringing in my ear. Um, but anyway, yeah, I'm going to get off of here now and go in here and probably make me a codfish sandwich. I have some hamburger buns and I'm just going to, I need to bake it in the oven. <laughs> I was going to say I'm going to fry it. <laughs> I don't know. We'll see. I've gotten away from fried foods, um, a lot. I'm not frying a whole lot of foods. I'm either, um, baking them or broiling them. So yeah we'll see but i'll check back in with you guys later all right y'all so this is what my reading my i guess glucose reading is right now 236 and i just finished eating i made a fish sandwich or fried a fish sandwich and i had a little bit of a bag of popcorn so sorry about the lighting i don't have any other lights on it is gloomy here today um so yeah i guess i just need to figure out what i can eat what i can't eat what spikes my sugar to go high and what doesn't um as long as i keep it under 200 i'm good so that reading was at 142 so, like I said, it updates every five minutes. I'm going to check it again at about mm, 2 o'clock, 2.15, and see if it's going down. All right, y'all. So, it is a little later in the day. It's about 5.35, and I am headed out to get these girls from team up from school. So, I'll touch back in with you guys they have a performance coming up next saturday i think it is a step performance that they're practicing for it's on the 6th so i think that's next week if not it's the week after so yeah hey y'all good morning it is what is today oh thursday and i'm just coming from my favorite place Get me a sausage biscuit because I cooked some hash browns at home, but I didn't have any sausage. Sausages or biscuits to make a sausage biscuit. So, I am heading into work. Whew. It's been a long week. But hey, the week is almost over. So, I've had my cup of coffee this morning. I feel like, I think... I don't know when <laughs> was the last video you guys saw but it's still my birthday month i'm still celebrating so i will see you guys on the inside <laughs> 